wholesale to be.com guys back again this video creating uh, to show you guys how to list items on eBay using the eBay listing tool with wholesale to be okay right now we have the dashboard what we're gonna do is um, um, this isn't no tips, tricks, or anything like this. This is a general overview on actually how to use the eBay uh, plan here. Um, if you click on your eBay plan, uh, it'll show you exactly which items you already have listed on eBay um, to push to eBay or whatever. And so, um, but what we're going to do is we're going to click on dropship products and we're going to find a category of items we want to sell. Okay. And so, um, Let's come over here to say battery chargers, okay? And um, let's click on. I guess it doesn't really matter. We just more batteries. We're going to we're going to um, find an item to sell on eBay. And all you if all you have to do to, to find an item to sell, you can click on just just this add to eBay list. Click this item, click confirm. Okay, close, and uh, you can go back and find a different item you want to sell. Okay, we're just going to click something randomly. Okay, let's do cell phones. All right, all right, Android phones. Some of you guys like that. Okay, six to seven inch Android phones, five inch Android phones. Let's do that. See what you got going on here. Got some name brands, some non-name brands, and things of that nature. Okay, and um, we, we can just click on uh, at eBay list. All right, and then click confirm. Access your your auction list. Okay, but what I like to do is I like to click on this item outright and see what the selling price for the item is. Okay. They'll tell you here, but it's not the same. I'm going to show you why. Okay. Wholesale to be actually sells this, this item with um, the other view doesn't calculate in the shipping. So the shipping with this item is $142.53. So $142 for this item if it's sold on eBay. We're going to push this item to eBay. Click on uh, eBay USA up there. And then we're going to click, scroll down and click confirm, uh, continue. Um, this little steps here says your token has already been created. You may proceed to the next step by clicking on the continue button. If you have not generated a token so that uh, wholesale to be can access your eBay account, you must do that. You need to click on that and go through all that, all that jazz. Okay. And so it says the suggested retail price for this item is $136. I $163. 31 cents I think not because we already know that it was going to cost us $142 to actually get this from eBay so this is definitely something they need to fix on here um, so our sell price on this item I'm going to say I'm going to go $220 okay and ship to uh, we're going to do a fixed price on that I'm gonna say I have two items and ship to uh, no shipping to P O box. Okay. Now in the title, from what I've learned is that eBay does not like it when you change up the title up here within the wholesale to be listing tool. You'll have to change the title once you get this item into your eBay account. I also to send you some some weirdness <laughs> so uh, I'll just leave all this the same uh, these options here you can click on make it bold or whatever you know um, click next step and then start listing in the appropriate category cell phones and accessories all right cell phone smartphone click next Okay, and we're gonna go here, PayPal. Okay, we're putting your PayPal ID. I'm not gonna put mine in here. I'm gonna say Visa, Mastercard, or whatever. Payment. Choose your, uh, choose your 
duration and condition. Um, actually, you can put in PayPal. Yeah, because I'm on PayPal. So, yeah, you guys know me. I'm Otto Thompson at gmail.com. Send me some money, baby. <laughs> All right, and then uh, uh, listen duration. You can guys can choose how long you want it listed. I'm a list it good until canceled. And item condition, it is new. Okay. Uh, brand required. Um, this brand, if you don't know, you just scroll back up. It'll show you the brand. Black Root Crown. This is like a generic cell phone. So we're going to say unbranded. All right. Um, I'm going to say does not re uh, apply if you do not know right off the bat. And um, you can go through and fill out all these additional operating systems and stuff like that if you know exactly what it is. Um, the way you can find that out is we, what we should have did is we should have did one of these numbers. We should have just uh, opened up a different window, a duplicate window, so you can copy and paste the additional stuff in here that you need. All right. And um, we should have did that, did that. That's what I normally do. All right, so next step, click next step, and it's going to show you what your listing looks like. It's already pre-made already, all right? But if you want something different, you can go down here and apply a different template. Let's go for one with... Uh, See if we got any tech, something techy. No. Video games, joystick. Yeah, video games. Go video game on them. So see, it changed up the way the, the listing looks or whatever. All right. So we'll use that. And then if you need to edit anything in the auction, you can click edit au auction content. You can change, write anything that you want, additional information in here for your product or whatever. And you can go push to eBay. It's kind of slow. Congratulations, your auction was created successfully. Will you receive confirmation email very shortly, including a link to your to your eBay auction, blah 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 blah, your unique thing, blah blah blah. Save your auction settings back to your auction list. So go back to your auction list, and that's what I'll do. I'll just go through here. And I'll start listing items. The good thing about this is um once they're on your auction list or whatever, you can go through here and you can see, you know. Uh, how many items they have in stock, you know, it'll say either in stock or the actual item in stock, you know, um, which is great. And then if you get an order, you can come over here and just click order. All right. And you can just go through the checkout process. All right. And so that's that we can go to, to eBay and we can check out, no, I'm not going to go my eBay list. Cause, uh, I got other items in there. That's not through from whole set of these one, even though that's the sample account. So that's how you use the wholesale to be eBay tool to uh, get you some sales. All right, guys, got th thank you for watching this video. And have any questions, contact me. All right, bye bye.